It's the dawn of a new era in this business. I mean, we're gonna see these docks being used in ways that we can't even dream of right now. You're gonna see these docks everywhere. They're gonna be in multiple applications and throughout multiple industries. 911, what's your emergency? I've never been as excited about a product in the eight years I've been in the drone business. Hi, my name's Don Garland. I'm the owner of Drones Plus. We're a drone company based in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. Ever since DJI announced their new drone dock nearly a year ago, we really couldn't wait to get our hands on our first demo unit. The wait's over. We received our first dock uh, yesterday and uh, wanted to share uh, with you just a few features about it. We like to keep our videos short. We're not in this to sell ads. Uh, we're drone guys. We plan to do a series of these, uh, getting more and more detailed uh, as we go. And as we get more experience with the dock, we start flying it and putting it in service. So let's get right into it and let's show you the dock. So now let's take a look at this exciting new product. First thing you'll notice is the size and aesthetics. The design engineering, it's practical. It just looks heavy and solid. It's designed like an expensive work truck that looks amazing, but you just know this thing is gonna perform under the most demanding environment. We aren't gonna get into the specs. We'll do a video on that later, but for now, I just wanna share with you the craftsmanship. Let's take a look at the power panel. Looks like a smaller version of a power panel built for a high-end yacht. The breakers for AC and DC power and the USB port are easily accessible and easy to understand. A push of this button manually opens the dock doors. The weatherproof doors open smoothly to reveal a special dock edition of the M30 slash M30T. It's already proven to be an outstanding workhorse in demanding environments. This edition M30 has connectors for recharging post-flight. The dock and drone have built-in RTK that allow for precision takeoffs, flights, and landings. Again, not getting into specs, but suffice to say radio range and battery power are impressive and more than adequate for a wide range of applications. Now let's take a look under the hood. Wow, I've seen a lot of other docks. Most are a mismatch of parts cobbled together. You look at this and it's like an expensive sports car. Very well designed. Everything is modular for ease of maintenance and repair. The air conditioning unit at the heart of the dock provides cooling between flights to ensure the batteries properly charge and are properly maintained. It gets the drone back in the air with the shortest possible recycle time. 